Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We're gonna be diving headfirst into everything luxury, everything high end, top shelf, fantasy, things that are worth the splurge. First, we're gonna dive into a little fashion. We're going full steam luxury, classic, almost capsule wardrobe type vibes with what I'm about to show you guys. And you're gonna see me trying on things. And we're gonna do that whole fashion moment, which I have recently been very, very into. So I wanted to chat a little fashion luxury before going into the makeup. And I wanna let you guys know that I do have a discount code for Lily Silk, confetti everywhere. This is a sponsored partnered video with Lily Silk. I am so pleased to be working with them again. I feel super honored. Honored. I love this brand. It is very much my style. I love pieces that I can invest in and wear season after season after season. This sweater we'll take a look at first. This again is the cashmere polo shirt. I just think this is a great transition piece into fall winter. It's really lightweight. You can layer it, easily pop a coat on top and you're not gonna feel too bulky. It just has a really nice softness. And James really loves this one on me. He's like, your shoulders look great, which I was like, I don't know. I'm getting a shoulder compliment. I'll take it. But he likes the structure of this shirt and it's just really flattering. Before we dive into more fashion, I do want to let you guys know there is a discount code. It is Tati20 for 20% off. That is good for seven days only. After that, it will be Tati15 for you guessed it. 15% off. So get some savings while you can. These are investment pieces and the quality is just A++++. So good. Okay, we're gonna move into the semi sheer cable knit baby cashmere sweater. And this is 100% cashmere. It is really, really lightweight. It's so breathable. It fits loose, but drapes in a way that just feels kind of sexy, but not overdone. You're not trying too hard. It's just hitting you in all the right places and draping and doing that slightly oversized, beautiful, classy thing that just makes you feel so elevated and so chic. I love how I feel in this sweater. You can pair this with so much and definitely layer it. Let's look at the Almafi, Alma. I can't say it. Gosh darn it, just when I think I'm fancy and fabulous. The Amalfi Stripe Silk Shirt. This is gorgeous. I had to order a second one because when Sabrina was visiting, she's a teacher and I'm like, she deserves to show up to school like looking just like in her female boss energy and teaching those children and just being like tailored and classic and feeling good and fabulous. So I gave her the shirt and then I was like, oh my gosh, I kind of needed that for filming. So they were so wonderful. They sent another one. This is their like number one seller. Everybody looks good in this shirt. This is such a beautiful classic piece that makes a statement, but it's one of those statements where it's like, you're not trying too hard. It just is. And you just give, I'm pulled together and my life is pulled together vibes. Do you ever feel like if your life is chaotic, but you're wearing the right outfit, you just feel like a little bit better? This shirt just makes me feel like everything is crisp. You can dress it up, you can dress it down. I think everyone needs a stripe shirt, a stripe blouse in their wardrobe. This comes in black and white or blue and white. If there is one investment piece that you could add to your wardrobe to have through fall winter, I think this is it. It is a tailored silk shirt. I love the olive green. I am obsessed with the feel of this, the sheen to it, just how it drapes. Again, I'm all about a good fit. And when you're buying something that is a little more not fast fashion, you know what I'm saying? The cut seems to be handled with a little more TLC. And of course the fabric quality is definitely gonna help how it's hitting the body and how the quality holds up. So I really feel like investing in blouses is the way to go. I've always told people, I'm like, there are areas where you can cut corners with a great 
quality blouse. Do not cut a corner there. If you can afford it, if you can make the investment, it's something you'll have for a very long time. All right, we're gonna talk about some trousers really quick that you could pair with literally any of what I just talked about, white trousers. So these are really beautiful, really flouncy, flowy trousers. They're so soft. Again, I am a comfort queen. I demand that my clothes not itch me or be uncomfortable. I wanna move around and feel like my clothes move with me. And so if I can feel like I'm in leisure wear, like I'm gonna go ahead and say it, like I wanna live my life feeling like I'm in pajamas and relaxed. So if I can get there, but look really structured and pulled together, that is such a win for me. And these trousers are really versatile and they make such a statement. A white trouser is a beautiful element to anyone's wardrobe. Fashion, luxury, we did it. I'm gonna reiterate the code TATI20, only good for seven days. Check out the description box for the link. Go peruse the site, you will not be disappointed. They have bedding even, and pajamas, and it's just like a fantasy fashion site. Just go check it out and have fun browsing. And if you purchase anything, use the code TATI20. All right, on to luxury goods for the face. We're talking makeup that just hits every high note that is worth the splurge. We're gonna start with the ridiculous. Please do not scream. I'm not requiring anyone to go out and purchase this. I'm just saying I tried it in the past. I didn't wanna like it. I bought it again. I swore I would never go back to that well because it was just a little bit too ridiculous. And then I was in Nordstrom the other day and I bought it again because it's just for some unknown reason that good. We're talking about the Sicily Double Tensor. This had its moment on YouTube when the beauty community was just cranking, when it was just the most popular thing ever. Everyone who did makeup tried this out. And as much as I think collectively, we all kind of wanted to hate on it, it is a beautiful primer that really does lift and firm and tone the skin. The technology in here is oat seed extract, which is said to give you a mesh covering on your skin. I was reading it online. It's like a second skin and makeup application will go on top of this kind of secretive liquid second skin that's just kind of firming you up and helping lines to not be as visible. It's really hydrating. It's a gel, it has a little bit of a stick to it and it definitely elongates the wear time of your makeup. So it is the most expensive item that I have here. So if you're shrieking, like, I'm so sorry, you can scream more if you wanna see the WTF from way back when. I tested this out and I went hard on it, but I love it. And it's just a joy to have in my collection again. That's funny, the, on the bottle it says instant and long-term. Yes, to both. It also has tiger nut and red wine extract if that helps you to justify the price. It is said to be a primer and skincare merged. Moving on to my next crazy expensive item that I am back like hardcore in love with. I didn't know if I would still like it. My skin is a little bit different. And I went and purchased the Chanel Sublimage Tint in the glass jar. I did a WTF on this one way back when as well. And Erica loved this one so much. I think she took one of my jars. I had two of them and we were just like, oh my gosh, I don't know what's in here, but this is like the best foundation ever. It says it's a light to medium, but you can actually build it up quite a bit. And the reviews online are hilarious. I have to pull one up because I was laughing, doing my research, laughing. Most people that love this have combo or dry skin, just to share that with you. I'm wearing it today. I feel like it applies beautifully with fingertips or in my personal preference, a velour puff, which might be kind of odd to some, but that is something that I enjoy to kind of do a swipe and pat in. It's always worked really well for me. I don't really love the brush that it comes with. It's kind of like, it's nice that it comes with a brush. I don't really like this brush as much. Vanilla Planifolia, PFA. This is a pure ingredient that is created through purification that is a technique developed by Chanel. This also contains diamond powder, if that 
does something for you and precious oils. So everything is just very elevated. It's one of those that just makes you feel like you're not wearing makeup, but gives you coverage at the same time. It sinks deeply into the skin. It makes the skin almost look like that glass skin, like it's bouncy. Like you, you look like you have more radiant bouncy skin. So if you're into that kind of a look, it's so worth it. It's like better than the La Mer. I've been using La Mer again and I wanted to try this one also. And I'm like, this is it. Okay, so let me find, okay, here we are. I'm on the Bloomingdale site and this woman leaves a review that I just love. It's so simple. She says, I am 85 years old and during COVID I rarely went out and now I am again wearing makeup and it took years off my face. So if an 85 year old is loving how this is sitting on the skin, then that tells you everything. It's hydrating, it's not going to exaggerate lines, and you can kind of look at this as a skincare foundation. Like you're getting foundation plus, if that helps you justify the price, this is a good one. I am having deja vu right now, wow. This might shock some of you guys. Some of you guys are like, no, oh, no, nothing shocks me anymore with Tati. <sighs> okay, when I kind of go hard on a brand or I don't like something, that's never like the whole brand. It's never the whole brand. There are items usually that'll be like, this is it, this is so good. So recently I spent $85 on a trio from Westman Atelier. I did not like it. I It's a cream, it's a shadow. The pigmentation just didn't do it for me. However, this $75 cream highlighter does do it for me. This is so gorgeous on the skin. I noticed that I don't get clogged pores on my highlight area the same way I do with other products. This has such a beautiful formulation, wonderful ingredients. It gives you such a nice, beautiful, dewy shine but no texture. You can put this on a beauty blender and bounce this on the high points of the face and it just brings this really beautiful, healthy skin glow right through the makeup. So if anything's looking a little too dry, you wanna add that shine, but you don't wanna enhance texture, the formula on this one is just something else. They have four different shades and I mean, there's no denying the the price. Wow, I mean, it's... it. <sighs> A little bit goes a long way. There is some coverage in here, which is interesting. And they mentioned that on the website that this is something that has both shimmer and a buildable coverage. So if you're not wearing any makeup at all and you want a little bit more than just like a see-through base on a cream highlight, then you might really love this. I think it's a winner. You can use it on the eyes as well. And it just is seamless. And that's what I love about it the most, the way that it melts into the skin is totally seamless and again, does not make your pores or lines worse, which sometimes with highlighters, you have to watch out for that. That can happen. You haven't seen me hold this in my hands in a while. This used to be behind me on a shelf when I filmed back in LA. This is the Guerlain Meteorites. We're gonna go outer space style right now because the technology that they share on their site about what this is literally takes you down this like tunnel of like, am I putting actual like encapsulated stardust on my face? Because this just like sounds too good to be true. The formula came out in 1987. So this is not a new item. This has been tested. People love this. It's kind of like, I feel like this is a cult secret. Like if you know, you know, because you can't swatch it. You don't really see it on the skin, but it definitely does this very subtle color correction and illumination. Like if your makeup is ever just looking kind of dull and dry and you're like, oh gosh, like I'm not gonna like wipe highlight all over my face. Like what am I gonna do? This is the kind of product that you literally dunk in and you just like swipe on and it is like a soft filter for your face. The lines are softened. It does have silica as an ingredient in here. So things just feel filled in and just like candle lit. Like you just look a little diffused. So this is a finishing powder. It does not reduce oil. So I would say those of you that are oily, powder your face first. 
use this as a true finishing powder. On their site, they say it has Stardust technology. I don't know what that is. I would really like to know what Stardust technology is. Whatever you are, you're really good. I don't know why these work better than any other finishing powder, but they do. I think this is the best one out there. If you're looking for that softening, this is definitely worth the investment. I would go with the classic not the limited editions. I've tried the limited editions before. I feel like they're too shimmery. The classics are my favorite. I have the shade three medium, which works for me. They do have lighter shades. They do have a deeper one, but I was reading on someone's blog that the deeper one still, even if you have deep skin, might be a skip. You might wanna try the medium with how it diffuses light. There's pretty much no color in here. So, you know, read up on it, but I would definitely say stick with the standard classic year round meteorites instead of the limited edition ones, in my opinion. Also the scent, gosh, it's just like violet candies. <sighs> Fragrance sometimes really does me dirty, so I have to be so careful, but I love this scent. Takes me right back. Okay, expensive eyeshadow. Do we need it? Do we not? Do we need any of this? Probably not. Do we want it? Yeah, I think we do. Some of this we want. Um, I love this palette. This is a new drop from Patrick Ta. You have creams in here, two of them, a deep espresso brown and a black. I am wearing the black as a liner today and the espresso brown I put on as a base in my crease. I love doing that move. I feel like it sets you up for success. And I am wearing this palette, a bunch of it, today on my eyes. These mattes are so buttery smooth. The formula is amazing. It has a little bit of a soft sheen. They're not shiny, they are mattes, but they have a nice glide to them where they're not crusty dry. They have great blendability, great pigmentation, and I am really, really impressed. I do not like most all matte palettes. I'm not gonna call out other brands, but if you don't see me getting really excited about something, then it's just kind of like, meh. Like if it's just so-so, if something's terrible, it goes in the bad bin and like we have a talk, you know what I'm saying? But if something's like, meh, then I try it and I'm like, not impressed, like it's fine. Um, if something's really, really wowing me, I definitely will find a way to bring it to you guys through a video like this or another try on, get ready, whatever. This has everything you need, everything you need. It's a $70 palette. I know, like, so expensive, but you can do your brows, you can do liner, you can do an everyday basic out the door one shadow look. You can go to town and do a full smoky eye or like a just full matte look that's a little more intense. I love this. I think you would get a lot of use out of it. Any level of makeup lover would be able to use it. It's very blendable, buildable. I wanna show you, like I'm building up this cream right now on the back of my hand, and it is the type of cream matte that is really useful for blending into other deeper shades. You really can work these all together like here's a brown mixed into. Do you see how they just blend one into the next? Really gorgeous, there's not a lot of kickback. I am very, very excited about this palette. Luxury worth the splurge, that's where we land. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe, ring the bell, make sure you expand that description box, go check out Lily Silk and use the code TATI20 for 20% off. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you're having a good one, whatever you are doing, and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah.